Hi everyone. Um, I just want to share this message really quick with you. Um, this is sort of an improv to video. Uh, no fancy lighting in the background, just me in the car. Um, waiting <laughs> for someone to come out um but this dropped in my spirit uh as it relates to um someone's life and what has been revealed to me you have been um hit pretty hard and for some of you it has hit you um, so deep and it has rocked you um, to the point where you're saying I can't cry another moment um, like this anymore I want to encourage you I know you've been encouraged a lot and I know you probably have seen social media to, to look for encouragement or to try to look for um, something to keep going because you've ran the end of your rope um and so this message is for you i'm talking to those who are anchored um in something that is greater um within them <clears throat> Some I'm talking to those who have truth, um, God's truth inside of them that you cannot shake, that you go to sleep with. It just it just doesn't let up. This is for those. It's for you. The reason why you were hit was for you to shift out of that cycle. It was for you to shift out of that cycle so that you could propel into a greater level of power, knowing the power that you have, knowing the power that God has given you to manifest those things that are not as though they already are, what already has been spoken into the atmosphere, what already has been um, predestined before the foundation of the world. Um, that hit was meant for you to propel to a higher level of consciousness. Um, a higher level of truth. To expand more of what you already know. Um, I know this word to be true. Um, I know this word to be true. Uh, to stand in that. To stand in to stand in that, to stand in that power, to stand in that truth. For many of you, you may have been studying how to, how the mind works or um, um, going through the same cycle kind of over and over again. And new cycles, there's a new cycle that is coming or that is already here. For some of you, there's a new cycle that is coming because you can, you can sense it. And then for many of you, the new cycle is already here. And what I mean by the new, new cycle, I mean by the new level of consciousness that you have awakened to, a higher level of consciousness um, that you have awakened to for what you have already known, from what you have known in the wilderness, for what you were taught in the wilderness, what you were pruned through in the wilderness, what you were um, shaped through in the wilderness, um, that the hit that you received was for you to propel and step into more of what you already have known, more of what God already ha God has already revealed and shown within you. And it has been a gift. And I know you may have thought that it was a hit in a bad way, but it actually propelled you into a level of consciousness of awakening to the power that you truly do have, to the power that you truly do have over your mind, to the power that you truly do have um, over those things that you may have been consumed by, um, to the power that the verse says, for I have given you the power to tread upon serpents. Um, the things that that you may have felt that was, when you think of a serpent and when you think of something like, you know, it's like 
when you think of a snake or you know a serpent um immediately thought is fear right uh, and this is the the parable that um that Christ is talking about. I have given you the power to tread upon serpents, those things that might have haunt you at night, those things that might have made you feel as though you were consumed and you may have been consumed like that over and over and over in this cycle. And the reason why you had that hit, that was <clears throat> your spirit, your soul, the answer to your prayer to push you, to propel you into the power that God is already giving you. But you needed a level of breaking, a level of consciousness to shift you into that awareness. There needed to be um, some some things that needed to uproot out of you that you had to release. This, for some of you, you had to know the power that you truly did, did uh, do have, um, and 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 it wouldn't have happened unless the fallow ground would it wouldn't the fellow the fallow ground had to break off. Do you get what I'm saying? And so um, this message is for you. So you're in a new cycle. So count a joy. Okay. Um, count a joy because you have made room now. It needs to happen so you can make room. So you can step into, walk into the alignment, walk into what you have been called to do. You have not called to live a life of suffering. You have not been called to live over and over again it is just heaven on your side there's your soul that's propelling you for the very thing that you have desired are you following me and so there needs to be a level of consciousness that needs to shift inside of you you need to make room for what god is preparing you for for what has already been established for that for the abundance for everything for everything that has been that has that blueprint that's inside of you that dna that birthright um so this message is for you i need you to awaken 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 to the truth awaken to the truth okay that's all it's been doing just like awakening right so you kind of have flickers right like you know, signs here and then boom. And it's like, uh -huh. it is to, to shake the fallow ground off of you so that you can awaken to the truth. And so that you can know the power and the truth that you already have within you, but you needed that stuff to be removed out of you. You needed that, um, that, that, that internal human baggage to re be removed out of you. So, because for many of you, God has created you differently. God has chosen you. Many are called, right? God has called you, but you've always been different. This message, you've always been different. And the reason why you have always been different is because you are. But you're different for a purpose. You're different for a reason. You're different for a higher calling, a higher love, a higher level of truth, a higher level of awareness to shift the consciousness on the on the face of the earth. Do you, are you following me? Um, so that's what I want to want to say that's why it happened okay um like share this message and um hope you're encouraged